vacation means. <laughs> but, but, but we sat down and we came up with some predictions that seem fairly safe... <laughs> ..for the news of next week that we can look back on as a last week. So you get the point. So, he <laughs> here goes. Um, our top stories. Last week, uh, LeBron James dunked a basketball. Um, <laughs> Forcefully, several times in front of Miami's largest collection of assholes. <laughs> um, just, yeah, easy bet, right? That's... That was just... The first one was easy. Um, additionally, an old rich man uh, last week was accused of racism or sexism <laughs> and, while trying to explain them away, only seemed more racist. <laughs> um, I'm not sure who that was, but we haven't heard much from Donald Trump in a while, so I'm guessing it was him. <laughs> Uh, in, in international news, uh, last week's situation in the Middle East was... let's say, complicated. Um, <laughs> those were all gimmies. Let's do some more uh, uh, difficult uh, speculative news. Um, in Mexico, congratulations to the drug cartels, uh, which, <laughs> which last week celebrated killing their one millionth bystander. <laughs> um, oh, also, oh, you, you, you regretted laughing at the setup there, didn't you? <laughs> You wait for the punchline or you get burned. That's a huge <laughs> teachable moment for you. Um, also, uh, a bit of a shock from the Vatican as the Pope joined Tinder and listed his status as down for whatevs. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, he's a new Pope. He's a, he's a refreshing change. Um, meanwhile, in Washington, America's most punk rock senator demanded answers about the four Americans lost in Fugazi. Where are they? Where are they? <laughs> It's been ages since their last album, and Hillary Clinton has some answering to do. Uh, in, uh, in sporting news, shocking news, uh, as another NFL player came out last week, and then every other NFL player came out. <laughs> it turns out the NFL has been entirely gay all this time. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. Uh, yes, yes. Uh... In business news, GM is now recalling cars made by other companies just to even the playing field. Uh, in entertainment news, an actor pretending to be a war hero was applauded for his bravery. Um, that, we all thank him for his pretend service. Uh, and a circus frightened as many children as it delighted. Uh, that's not so much news as just a very safe bet. Uh, and in your personal news, uh, you cancelled on your aunt's Memorial Day cookout tomorrow because there's no way you're going to that thing. No way. <laughs> Finally, uh, tonight, the winning Powerball numbers were... 13, 34, 7, 45, 51 and 20. Now, I realise that is a bold prediction to have made a week in advance, but holy shit, imagine if we nailed that one. <laughs> Just... Imagine that! <laughs> yes! Uh, thank you so much for watching this week. Uh, feel free to watch more videos here on our YouTube channel uh, or tweet at us uh, at last week tonight to tell us how accurate our predictions were. Uh, we'll be back next Sunday night with a new episode at 11pm on HBO, unless, of course, we nailed the lottery numbers, in which case, fuck off and we will see you never. <laughs> We don't need you! We're rich! We're rich! Join us next week.